Hello everybody, what is up and welcome back to my let's play of Mass Effect Andromeda and if I sound a bit off, well it's kind of because I messed up on my last two recordings. So yeah, I'm going to have to skip like a, a good hour of the game got lost. And let me explain let me explain why. Okay. In order to record a video on the PS4, you have to double tap the share button. And in order to stop the recording, you also have to double tap the share button. Now, here's where I screwed up. The first time, I was just checking around my settings because I got a new headset recently. The uh, um, Afterglow Level 3, it was only like 30 bucks at my store, so... I figured, heck, why not get it? So I got it, and guess what? It's awesome. But the issue was, with the first episode I tried recording, which was going to be episode 4, I forgot, or well, I didn't forget, but I, I didn't know how to make the audio output go to the headset, and instead it kept just coming out of the TV. And while fiddling around, I accidentally brought up the share menu. Here's the problem with the PS4 share. If you don't double tap to stop the recording, or if you just accidentally tap it once, or if it doesn't like register the second tap, it'll bring up the share menu. And here's the problem. Once it brings up the share menu, your video is gone. It does not pause it. It does not stop it. It doesn't save it. It's just gone. As soon as you exit the share menu, your video is done. It's gone. It doesn't save it at all. So that is what happened on the last two episodes. The first time I inadvertently hit the share menu while trying to figure out how to fix my headset, which I didn't even have to do that. And the second time I was legitimately trying to double tap the share button, but for some reason, I guess it didn't register it correctly and just brought up the share menu and all of the data was lost, or all the video was lost, I'm sorry. So, unfortunately, this episode I'm going to have to skip quite a bit of stuff. But, I mean, not really very much happened, all that really happened was like a, like a ton of cutscenes. We, um, got onto this ship called the Nexus, which is supposed to be the ship that's, uh, uh, like for mankind's integration into the Andromeda galaxy, I guess. But there are these planets which are known as habitats, and there's like, um, I forget how many they said. There was like, tw like twelve or something suitable habitats. And the first habitat that we arrived on, which is the one that I have recorded video footage of, is Habitat Seven. Unfortunately, I haven't gotten to the next habitat, but I'm hoping to do that in this episode. But I want to make this episode kind of short because, well, I'm actually waiting right now for my copy of Persona 5 to be downloaded. Yay! Which means I can actually start doing my Let's Play of Persona 5 tonight. Oh my gosh, in just two hours, just two more hours, it'll be done. Ah, crap, it's gonna be, shoot, it's gonna be nine by the time that happens. Oh man, uh, crap. I can't be too loud, unfortunately. I'm not, I, I can't really be too loud while recording it, because, um, nine o'clock is my niece's bedtime, and when my niece goes to bed, I can't be that loud. But, you know, just a little while ago, we had people staying at my house where they were sleeping, like, right out in the living room. And he, the guy who was staying, he absolutely hated any tiny little sound I, could, I would make. He would get mad. And it's like, dude, people make noise. It's natural. You make noise. And he would get mad at me at thing about things that that like he would do. So in other words, he was a hypocrite. 
Okay, I I'm going to stop ranting, and I'm just going to focus on the game, because I should not be getting mad or worked up or anything like that. But yes, Persona 5 is coming out in two hours. And I am so looking forward to it. Anyways, so we got to meet all the uh, commanders of this place. And in the last episode, uh, at the very end of the last episode that I did, that did not record, or that didn't record the video correctly because I didn't double tap the share button correctly, um, I found my father's cabin in the, uh, um, shoot, god darn it, I can't even remember the name of our ship. It's not Excelion. What was it? It was, a. Uh, Christ, I can't even remember what it is. Anyways, Alice, God, whatever. Welcome back to Sam Nood. I've adjusted my connection to your implant. The headache you experienced before shouldn't reoccur. Oh, well that's nice yeah, what to was know. That about? You said we need to discuss something confidential. You should know certain facts before you leave on your expedition. It seemed best we speak alone. Uh, don't hide things or why the secrecy? I don't understand the need for secrecy. Your father felt it was for the best. What was he trying to hide? My true capabilities. Ooh. Alec overrode the implant safety protocols. It allows me unrestricted access to the Pathfinder's physiology. Ha! Huh. And that's me now. And so, you, what does that I mean can exactly? I a force multiplier, dramatically enhancing your motor and neural skills when required. What? Alec called them profiles. They provide unique tactical augmentation during combat. Your father preferred to keep this fact to himself. Um. I wonder why it could scare people or secrecy breeds paranoia? Um, I'm gonna go with it could scare some people. People might get the wrong idea. Exactly. Super soldiers, a computer having control over a human. Providing an enhancement to the human. It is a symbiotic relationship that benefits both. Good. What do you get? Good. I like so symbiosis. Design, I am fully sentient. Far beyond what even the initiative understands. <coughs> no, follow. You're an AI. So what's different? I am a new form of AI, drawing directly from the human experience. Your implant is my window into the world. Oh, I get it. I'm still the boss. But you're just a computer. Wow. That's pretty amazing. But beyond what many people will accept, your father knew some would fear it. Yeah, he's got a point. So what does this mean for the two of us? Why fear it? I find it? myself in an unusual position. It's the human Though evolution. I father's experiences, there is a gap in my understanding. A gap? So? He placed a block on portions of my memory array. Why? Perhaps so when you asked me what his plan was, I wouldn't know. <sighs> and Dad strikes again. But not what? without recourse. The further you explore as a part How did he do that? Will be removed. Perhaps you should begin in your father's quarters. In the meantime, unless you have more questions, your new ship awaits. Awesome. Thanks. Thanks, Sam. Oh, what? Wait, 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 wait. Oh, oh, whoa. It just brought this up for me, so... These are the profiles I could choose from. Profiles allow Sam to reconfigure Ryder's implant for superior battlefield performance. Select a profile and press X to activate it. Ooh, yes, I get to choose my class. What to choose? Soldier rank one. Soldiers are pure combat specialists. No one is tougher or more effective at taking down enemies with gunfire. <clears throat> this profile optimizes Ryder's mind and body for superior mastery of his armor and weapons. For soldier rank two, 24 skill points invested in combat. Makes sense. Rank one bonus, 10% weapon damage. 10% weapon accuracy, plus 2 to damage resistance, 10% weapon clip size, nice, and marksman's focus uh, grants an escalating damage bonus for every target killed in a short time, nice, and then there's engineer, I like how the images show like the muscles and then it shows, I'm guessing this is like the nervous system, engineer, it's locked though. Huh. Engineers are experts in both offense and defensive tech powers. This profile re reconfigures Ryder's implant, enabling him to maintain constant control of a small combat drone, which assists and protects him in battle. 
That's nice. Oh, I gotta let my dogs out. My mom's probably home. Oh, shush. Watch out. Gosh. Jeez, dogs. God. Okay. Oh, yeah, she's home. I can, I can hear the garage door opening right now. And it's, like, right by my room, so... Even with my headphones on, I can still hear it. Anyways, rank one bonus. 20% all or six skill points invested in tech. Oh, that's all I gotta do to unlock it. 20% all combo damage? All combo damage? Ooh. 20% tech construction... Tech construct health? What is that? 20% tech construct health regeneration? 20% tech construct damage? 20% tech restoration and defense? Combat drone, a small drone, improves recharge rate for tech powers and self-destructs with an EMP pulse if enemies get close. The improved recharge rate is lost after destruction. Nice. What was it for this one? Oh yeah, Marksman's Focus. <coughs> and then there's Adept. Ooh. This one, I'm guessing, shows like... I'm not sure what this one's showing. Adepts are biotic specialists capable of disabling and killing enemies with powerful mass effect fields. This profile requires Rider's biotic implant enabling him to defeat his opponents without firing a single shot. Unlock adapt sk six skill points invested in biotics. Oh, whoops. Rank one bonus, 15% biotic force, 15% biotic area of effect damage, 15% biotic area of effect radius, 20% biotic effect duration, 20% biotic combo radius, biotic echoes, Biotic combos can set off additional explosions on each enemy they touch. Ooh. Biotic jump and evades. Instead of a jump jet, use biotics to jump and evade. However you do that, I'm not sure. Um, that sounds pretty cool, though. But I can't even activate any of these because I don't have enough skill points into anything, do I? Oh, whoops. I didn't mean to do that. And then Sentinel. Ooh, Sentinel looks pretty cool. Sentinels are unique combatants, bringing a mix of tech and biotic abilities to the battlefield. This profile creates a direct link between Ryder's implant and his armor's built-in computer systems, granting him additional protection via flash forge shielding. What? Three points, three skill points, each invested in biotics and tech. <sighs> Rank 1 bonus, 15% all combo damage, 10% tech recharge speed, 20% power shield cost reduction, 20% power restoration and defense, tech armor absorbs a significant amount of whatever damage gets past shields. Vanguard. Vanguards have an aggressive and have an aggressive combat style, preferring to close in on enemies and deal heavy damage at short range. This profile reconfigures Rider's implant and physiology. What what does it mean? Cannot download. What does that mean? Cannot download. And that's for my um, Uncharted Four. I don't get it. What what can it not download? The update or something? Anyways. This profile reconfigures Ryder's implant and physiology in subtle ways, allowing him to absorb energy from enemies on impact and shunt that energy into reinforcing his shields. Nice. Into combat and biotics. Nice. This seems pretty cool. The uh, Vanguard. Rank 1 bonus. 20% melee damage. 50% melee force. 10% biotic recharge speed. 20% power shield cost reduction. 10% max shields. Siphoning strike. Melee attacks restore shields. Nice. Biotic jump and evades. Yes, again, it has the biotic jumps. Okay. Infiltrator. Infiltrators are tech and combat specialists who typically focus on precise hits and avoidance. This profile enhances Rider's mental and visual equi equity, equity, allowing him to keep track of his enemies through a chaotic battle throughout a chaotic battle. That's important. Especially in this kind of game where I just get lost like super easily when it comes to the camera controls. <laughs> Three points each invested in combat and tech. 
Rank 1 bonus, 20% weapon accuracy, 20% weapon stability, 20% tech recharge speed, 10% weapon headshot weak point bonus. Ooh. Battlefield awareness. Observe enemies through walls when using a scope. Oh, it's like that one uh, site for... Uh, it's like that one site in uh, Advanced Warfare. The one that lets you see enemies that are standing still through walls or whatever. Okay, cloak evades. While evading, a brief cloaking device is activated. Okay, and then the last one is Explorer. The Explorer is a jack of all trades with abilities ranging from combat and tech to biotics. This profile reconfigures Ryder's mind and body to be as versatile as possible, permitting him to switch rapidly between firing weapons, deploying technology, and wielding biotic powers. Hmm. Unlock Explorer. Two skill points, each invested in combat, tech, and biotics. Rank 1 bonus. 5% weapon damage, five, plus 5 damage resistance. Wow, that's... That's good. 15% tech recharge speed, 15% biotic power damage. Oops, I bumped my mic. 15% power restoration and defense. Biotic blink allow... Uh, evades allow you to quickly traverse a short distance, even seemingly passing through solid matter. You know what? I think the Explorer actually sounds pretty good, but it's locked. The only one that's not locked is the freaking Soldier, so you have to go with this one. That's dumb. Oh, I didn't even mean to choose. Oh, blah. I didn't even know I was in the main menu. I'm sorry. I'm retarded. But at least we got that taken care of. Okay. Um. Hey guys, what's up? What's that? Uh, isn't that a problem? That that's open and like sparking like that? I should probably stop soon. I need to get to my ship though. Seems like my ship is higher up though, like on a higher level. Lonnie, what do you have to say? Pathfinder, it's good to see you. <coughs> Word is there's been trouble on the station. Where do you hear that? We just got here. How did you know that already? Word gets around. Does it now? Yes, indeed People it talk does. To me? Anyway, as soon as we establish outposts, everything will even out. I'm sure of it. <laughs> People just talk to you. Yeah, I know. I know how that is. Uh, and your family? Who are you? Why are you here? Oh, I thought you said, who are you again? Why are you here? What's it like here? Eh, talk to you later. I have to go now. See you later. Later. Yeah, I wish I could just stay and talk with her. And technically, I could do that if I wanted to. But I feel like it's actually more important right now to go and find my freaking ship. But... Well, hold on. What's going on? Do I have to go through this thing? No, because I can't go through that thing. Oh, it, it, isn't this that one chick? The one who's, like, completely uptight? Let's talk to Ryder. her. You're not on the bridge, Captain? We powered it down. Can't afford to waste energy. Though Cryo Bay and Sam Note are exempt. And I told them to keep their hands off Alex quarters. You have access now. Thanks. Oh, thank you. Hey, sorry about your father. He was really good at what he did. Even though Just you completely so objected to him. He was right about going planet side, though. I miss him. I didn't really know him. Wow. Oh my gosh. <laughs> he was difficult. Only work matters. As long as they did their jobs, he didn't care what people thought of him. I noticed that. If there's anything else I can help with, let me know. Dang it, I keep bumping my mic. I'm sorry. Thanks for the talk. All right. I have a request to submit administrators to harass and people to wake up. I'd better get to it. Good cool. luck out there. You too. Good luck. Good luck harassing those administrators. So this is the atrium. Okay, I'm pretty much sure I'm supposed to go this way. Because there's no other way I th could think of to go. But forward. But I thought that... See, look. There's... Where am I supposed to go from here? Oh, this way? 
Eventually, I'll find my way around this place. Okay, I think I know where to go. What are you doing, dude? Tired of standing? Tired of standing? Kneel down! Okay, let's go. I need to stop this recording here soon, though. Because... It probably has been going on for a while. I'm just going to have to be extremely careful with when I save. Or, I mean, save the video. My game just saved. Because, you know, it auto-saves. I really wish I could get a lot more done. Like, I wish I could get to the next habitat and all that. Why? Okay. So I'm going... So I'm supposed to go this way. I am, like, the most lost person in the whole freaking galaxy right now. She'll be pleased. But, you know what? I'm pretty much sure I'm not going the right way. Right, no, it See, there's an arrow pointing down. Okay, I want to try and find where I'm supposed to be going here. I want to actually find where I'm supposed to be going here. Okay, there's an exclama exclamation mark here. What does that mean? Can I talk to you? Pathfinder, no time for our beer yet. This place is a mess. Security is it. Let's call it strained. I can believe it. The Nexus is running on empty. Not just that. A lot of the exiles were security. Everyone was trained and armed for Frontier. We know Ket are dangerous, and now we have to worry about our people too. No idea where they went, but they left mad. Oh god. Let's not write them off. Uh, yeah. They were frustrated. If they just wanted to kill, they could have fought to the last here. Apparently we're the big hope for everyone. Not the Hyperion showing. Just us. I'm with you. It's just... a lot. Um, as long as the Nexus is here, yeah. as long as we're here, we have a job to do. Double down crisis mode. I can do that. We can do that. Ready and willing, Pathfinder. Double down crisis mode? Oh, yeah, that sounds awesome. Double down crisis mode, like a boss. But the planet was toxic. What if they store oxygen in porous tissue, like Quiro's rockfish? Am I supposed I to talk to you? I think you I am. the Pathfinder. Wonderful. You and your Sam are exactly what we need. Didn't we already Thanks, meet? Mr. Professor Herrick. My colleagues and I oh, will work Herrick. with your Sam and the data you gather to solve Andromeda's scientific mysteries. Can I join I'm in? usually out in the field, but I wouldn't mind talking shop. Uh, lab. You know. You are always welcome. It's not that we've had much to study, with everyone cooped up for 14 months. But your data on the Scourge flows like poetry. Now we can better advise on repairing the damage it caused. And maybe Addison will give us a real workspace. Who can <laughs> think with all this racket? I can't think with all this racket. Engineering update. We are working on accessing more power from the Hyperion. Man, there's like a bunch of people I'm supposed to be going and talking to. And I have no clue how to get to them. Isn't he one of the people I'm supposed to be talking to? Let's talk to you. I know that look. The others bent your ear, did they? Something like that? You get used to it. Just focus on being a Pathfinder. Can't argue with results. Though they'll try. Anyway, welcome to Militia uh, Though they'll try. Excuse the mess. This office fields militia work, Nexus security, and looking for the Turian Ark. What's the word on the Turian Ark? Scattered readings. Some indicate the Natanus was destroyed, others that people are alive. Who knows? If you need anything, come see me, even if it's just a vent. Bye, Kandros. Duty calls. You and me both, Pathfinder. Alright. Go to your ship. How? Do I seriously need to go back the way I came? I do. Like... 
Oh, 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 I see. I see. It's because I didn't... I didn't click the right one. Oh, you're coming with Pathfinder me? Pathfinder en route. How's the ship? In final checks, looking great. We won't be long. The way things are going, we'll be on our own out there. In other words, we're making this up as we go. <laughs> we awesome. used to call that tactical I... improvisation. I love it. But Let's swing it. But at least we'll it. be doing it in style. Hell yeah, dude. I'm winging it. Winging it. Ooh. They call her the Tempest. The Tempest? What is it? Oh. Ooh, it's my new ship. Sweet. Huh. I was hearing a little bit of an audio glitch Let's there, though, it sounded look. like. Let's pick it up a bit, people. We're 14 months late. <laughs> We're 14 months late. Yep. So you're the one who's making everything happen. And you are... Vetra. Vetra Nix. Initiative Wrangler, Provisioner, Gunner, and everything in between. Are we ready? Nice. The sooner we get out of here, the better. You're coming with us? Yes. Otherwise, there's no way they're letting this ship off the station. Alright, let's get out there. Yeah. Let's go see the rest of Helios. Hold it, hold it! You're not going anywhere. Damn it. Uh, is there a problem? Is something wrong? Director Addison wants to see a complete report of the Tempest supplies, munitions, and crew. Director Tan overruled Addison. The ship's loaded out with equipment for outpost discovery, squarely under Director Addison's purview. Seen you around. Ben, right? Came here with the family, didn't you? Son still in cryo? I could pull some strings, get him to the front of the line. Really? Yeah, really. They told me he wasn't essential, but I miss him. I know. I got family too, Ben. It's done. Addison's gonna kill me. Smooth. Nicely done. Part of the job, Pathfinder. All things considered, it was an easy ask. And right now, you need people tearing down obstacles, not putting up more. I know, really. Finally, someone who cares about doing stuff and not just talking about Initiated. it. Initiated! I've been initiated. Oh crap. I need to stop the recording. Oh crap. Cutscenes. Oh crap. Okay, I'm joking. <laughs> ah, come on. Load, load, load faster so we can get through this cutscene. What was that? I just heard like a loud noise. Oh, it's my Everything niece. State of the Never art. mind. Labs, sensors, exploration gear. Lesser crew, of course. The cool. best in their field. Glad to see you're doing awesome. so well, Scott. The engine core is based on the Ark's Odyssey drive. It runs a hell of a lot quieter. That's Gil Brody. Engineer, mechanic, all-around wrench jockey. Cool. We call this the research room. There's space for upgrading equipment, gathering intel. And a huge holograph of the Nexus. connection to Tempest. Welcome aboard, Sam. And Ryder, of course. All run by Suvi Anwar, our science officer. Your quarters are below. Plenty of space up here to get everyone It's together. funny how she says, it's welcome aboard, Sam She's and stealthy, Ryder. And Should you say class. it the other way around? Okay. Um, this will be an adventure. It's really going to be something, isn't it? I haven't even shown you the best part. When you're ready to fly, head over to the bridge. Our pilot should have everything good to go. Sweet! 
I want to fly it, and I want to fire missiles, and I want to fire laser beams, and I want to get into Gundam battles. Oh wait, this isn't Gundam. Okay, well, what? Yes, I got a level up, skill up, three skill Better points. Head to the bridge when we're ready. Oh.